My name is Willie Webb. I live in Miami Gardens, Florida. I'm a cover off franchise owner. I've done a lot of a lot of years of custodial work. I've worked for Northern Senior High School, Jackson Memorial Hospital, for the health department for the past seven to eight years. For the fire department as a support service coordinator where I handle most of the facilities, uh, maintenance stuff. For the most part, I get up in the morning about seven o'clock. Uh, I leave, I head to the fire department. I work eight hours there, then I leave there and I go to the uh, health department where I also work full time. After which I leave and then I go check on my contracts and if I have work to do, I'll work. So some days it's very hectic, some days I get sleep, some days I don't get sleep. I've always been a hard working person. I've all, you know, most of my life I've worked two jobs. So, you know, I've always worked long hours. You know, where, you know, because you know you have to be the breadwinner for your family. Hi Dad. Hey man, what's up? <laughs> He's gonna ask you for a video game. I'm married. I have six kids. Well, I don't really see the kids that much because of all, all the work that I currently have right now. My name is Roseman Webb. I'm married to Willie Webb. I met Willie at the time he was my supervisor, and we eventually started dating and we got married. And um, all together, we've been married 11 years. You don't want to? Life at home on a regular day during school my day starts at 5.30. I wake up, I drop my son to the bus stop. I come back here, I take care of my, my younger son, the eight-year-old, and off I go, I drop him to school, and then I report to work as a school teacher. And my day ends at three. I pick them up, drop them home, and off I go to, to school. I've enrolled in school in 2007 at Nova in the PhD for psychology. What's that? We got a package. My daughter and I, we do help out with the uh, cleaning. And after school, nine o'clock, we go, we help out with the cleaning. I come back home three, four o'clock in the morning. At times I get to sleep one, two hours. At times no sleep at all. That's the kind of sacrifice, but we get it going. I had always wanted, uh, you know, some sort of business. I thought cleaning would be good. Somebody always needs cleaning. I work you know, every day I'm responsible for like 10 to 11 buildings and I get paid pennies, you know, so I said, sure, if I can start a franchise to recover all that, if I can wind up with 10 or 11 buildings, you know, I, I could be pretty successful. Although Willie knew that he wanted to become independent, he still needed some encouragement to take that first step. I had doubts as far as would I be able to handle the workload. I was skeptic about doing it, so my wife, you know, she kind of nudged me a little bit, and sometimes you need that little nudge. My husband was saying, uh, with me having those two jobs, I don't think it is the right time, and you know, let's, let's, let's wait a while. We waited five months, six months. I said, okay, I think that's enough waiting. So she, you know, kind of told me, you know, it was time, and I was like, no, I didn't think it was the right time. And, um, but we decided to, to, to venture off anyway, so we put the down payment in and we went into it. But simply investing in a new coverall franchise was only the first step for the Webb family. Willie soon realized that for this family endeavor to be successful, he would have to learn to run a business and make certain compromises. I had to take a back seat to certain things and I had to have a listening ear at times you know, as to how I need to approach things. He's more out there, he sees what needs to be done, what equipment needs to be purchased and stuff like that, and he doesn't have time to be very focused and organized, so that falls back on, on me. So we had to come to some kind of co common ground amongst each other, you know, to work it as a family, and we, we did. We had a nice little system going and everything worked out fine. And six months later, Coverall called us for a second contract, which kind of eased it a little bit because we were able to hire employees then, because in the beginning, we did it ourselves. It was myself, my wife. We all had to make, you know, a lot of sacrifices. My son, he wanted to play basketball, but, you know, we had to opt out because we had a business that was a priority at the time. But he was patient and he hung in there and uh, he, he babysitted. I know a lot of days he wanted to not do it, but you know, I was proud that he stood up when we needed him the most and uh, took care of those things. As with any new business, getting started may seem overwhelming, but as Willie realized, Coverall offers the most comprehensive training and support in the industry. In the beginning, starting with Coverall, 
I was a little scared. And, um, you know, when you got your initial package uh, of things that they gave you, um, I was like, wow, am I going to be able to get the job done with, with just this stuff? But then after talking with them and realizing what I need, yeah, when I realized that I had their full support, yeah, it, it made things a lot easier for me. They were very patient with me as far as trying to help them complete the training because I was trying to fast track it. And they kind of slowed me down and said, no, you got to take your time because you have to know this material. You have to know what we're about. You have to know. So I liked that part. They introduce you to the, the people that you're going to be working for. You get a tour of the building. And it's basically your decision if you want to take it or not. If you feel like you can't handle it, they give you that option. You know, does this appear to be too much for you? You know, so I, I did like that part of, of when, when Coverall went out there with us. The uh, field reps were pretty good with us. You know, they've been very supportive financially by uh, assisting us with the financing. Uh, sometimes it didn't really have to take things out of our pocket. It came out later on the back end. When you take additional business, there's a process a, that they go through as uh, far as figures are concerned. All right, so they throw those numbers out there to you. They let you explain it to the fullest of what it's going to cost you for the additional business. They sit down and ask what kind of payment plan would you like to be on? Do you want to pay this off fast? Do you want to uh, go slow with it? Do you want to spread that out over 12 months? They, they work to see how it's going to, what's most convenient for you. And I appreciate that because it just showed me that they care. For Willie, being a coverall franchise owner has taught him to run a successful business. But more importantly, it has motivated him and his family to strive for success and to realize their hopes and aspirations. Since I became a coverall franchise owner, uh, yeah, it, it has made me a little bit more organized. It made me a little bit more focused. The relationships with the client are extremely important. Uh, you, you have to be able to, to get out there. If they don't see you, then they feel like you're just collecting their money. Walkthroughs and showing them that you've been there, or they heard that you've been there. Uh, emails, uh, phone calls, you know, all that stuff is extremely important. I have to worry about people being paid on time. Uh, I have to make sure all my paperwork is in order. You're learning about, you know, how, how to manage your books and you're, you're constantly trying to figure out ways to save. So your mind is constantly working on how to improve your business or how to improve your lifestyle. But I've realized you, you, can, you can really grow through coverall. Being a coverall franchise owner has afforded us more opportunities. Oh, that's AJ's jacket. It has given us a, a better lifestyle less worries, we're able to go on more vacations, we're able to secure jobs for other people, which is important for us. Because in this economy, where jobs are very scarce and lost very easily, the fact that we're in, we're in a position, we're part of a, a solution, we're able to tell people, look, we are here also. So if, we, if you want a job, we can see how we can employ you. And also it has helped us with our, our children that life is not just, okay, if, if you want this, you can have it. You have to know how things are provided for. You have to work hard. You have to, you know, just give, give of yourself, have a dream and hold on to it and make things happen. We continue like we're doing now. It may get to a point to where we don't have to work. We can just manage. And to me, we're, we're almost there. I'm very happy because I can see a certain future. I see growth. And one day I'll be able to be on the beach in, in Hawaii from my laptop communicating and having people work, making sure I'm keeping people employed Families are, will be able to eat and pay their bills in this economy, but I'll also be able to enjoy, you know, the life that I wanted. If I met somebody who was looking to become a franchise owner or thinking about it, um, I would I would tell them to, to go for it because you know Coverall is a, is a strong company and uh, that they are there for you. You don't have to worry about your money being wasted. Uh, you're gonna get what you put into it. It definitely can change your life for the better, as uh, far as, you know, just, just your lifestyle in general. You as a person, uh, feeling better about yourself, to know that you've accomplished something. So it helps motiv motivate you inside and make you feel like, hey, I am so, I, I can be a businessman, you know, I, I can maybe run a big company one day, which makes me feel better as a person. 
you know, so with the, you know, the hard work and the hours I put in, uh, sometimes, you know, you feel like you're not appreciated, you're working and you're doing this here, but then either, your, you know, your wife or your kid may say something to you that just makes it like, yeah, it's, it's really worth the while. Having become a couple of our franchise owner has been the, the most important decision that I've made. <laughs>